getting hot in there. Eventually, you're gonna run out of excuses, General. A cool name. Where does it come from? From my parents. Where you think it comes from? The moons? Yeah, but <laughs> okay. Focus. How much you want for the bombs? Sapa doesn't have much to offer. They're suffering from the same invasion you are. A bomb for a fish. How does that sound for a trade? I could make that happen, especially if you like Senecta. Senecta tastes like Zort. My gourmet days are far behind me. We'd be happy with any food not coming from the junkyard. We have a deal, then. We know the drone patrol's routines, so organizing transport through the Daoka shouldn't be an issue. Should I send the first shipment now? Not sure you noticed, but the Nom Noms are healthy again. I heard! That's great news for the Talan Ox. How's it going with the smoke grenades? It's going good. We're throwing the grenades inside storage rooms filled with green and red halidium. By the time the smoke dissipates, the Talon Ops are gone with the loot, and the robots don't know what hit them. Your Talan Ops uses Nom Noms, right? This is where the invaders are storing Blue H before they ship it to their planet. Music to my ears. Are Nom Noms part of your revolution plan? I don't use Nom Noms. I suffer from vertigo. But the Talan Ops do. Thanks. I'll be back. I'll be here. Giant alien spiders.
flock of killer birds, just what I need. chasing me. run out of space. with the jars guys we're almost done remember to load them slowly one bomb at a time what part of one bomb at a time didn't you understand this will take all moon if we don't speed things Ozort! Ah! Ozort! 
If the bomb hits the cart, we're all meeting with the yachts. Take cover! I got this. Trapping. A pico. And catch. Huh, that's impressive reflexes, Brom. And a legwork. First league. Fifteen cycles of foot rock payoff. I used to play defense. I want you on my team, champ. Now go. I'd be very cautious with the shipment. I hope the ventilope clock and sap to know what it's doing. How are you? This is Dasan. How do you think I am? I reckon you could use again Dalapot's assistance? Hey, Baram. Thanks for the contact in Dasan. He came through. I'm glad he survived. How is Brom? He's holding up. Sends you his best. Yes? Best what? It's... Never mind. Are we moving forward with our plan? Yeah, but if we want more bombs, you'll have to start organizing Senecta shipments to feed Dasan. The miners are willing to trade. I'll ask the Fisher to lands to prepare something. Now, we need a targeting system for the bombs, but that's not your problem. Here's what you can help out with. We'll be much stronger if you and I are tames more ventilopes. Give him a hand, will you? I'm with you. If you design the beacon, I can use Oru's gun to mark the bombing area so the ventilopes can spot it from the sky. Hmm. Filling Krakit glands with female ventilope oil could work. Adding green halidium to increase the beacon's radius wouldn't be half bad either. But I don't have the skills to assemble all that myself. I can draw a plan with a list of ingredients, but you have to find someone else who can help with the production. 
Remember what we spoke about. Now go! Hey, Lias. I have plans. I also have plans. I'm sharing a meal with my ventilope tonight. Sounds romantic. And awkward. I mean, Baram gave me plans. Instructions on how to build a beacon to trigger ventilope bombings. I didn't know you could build such things, Ulukai. Yeah, well, I can't. I have to find someone to help me with that. You should try your luck in Procriana, then. I have to go. My ventilope is hungry. Thank you for the spare parts. They were really useful. Don't thank me. You should trust the Dalatai Guardians a bit more. Lias is on our side, you know. Trusting them is what got Hume reverted. I prefer to remain anonymous. Anyway, they are ready. That's... impressive, Nurkan. <laughs> good job. Lias, I got good news. If you come to the same secret coordinates, you'll find a batch of usable weapons waiting for you and the Dalatai Guardians. This could change everything, Ulukai. I'd like to meet with the Recreator to thank him in person. I promise to protect his identity. He's being very cautious after what happened to his friends. I understand. Thank you, Ulukai. The Dalatai Guardians will equip shortly. And Liaz? Please be careful with that stuff. I'll show you soon how it works, but it's next level. Slate out. Hi, Nurkan. Have a souvenir. It's free. Look at this plan, Nurkan. All the way from Baram and Sapa. I need this to bomb our enemies. Can you build it? Let me see. A Ventolo beacon. Interesting. Very interesting. Combined with bombs. Is that what you said? Nice. I could build this, but you'd have to supply the necessary components. Deal? Deal. I'll get on it. Looks like your partner is proud of what you did. I couldn't have done it without you, Ulakai. Thank you. Hyun can finally revert. He was born to fight the invaders and free Adelpha. Sadly, his time came before he could accomplish his destiny. I am humbled he trusted me enough to do this on his behalf. His hazardous has waited long enough to return to the odds. So, what about you, Nurkan? What do you mean? You must have your own purpose in life, too. So what is it? I... I first thought the odds wanted me to recreate again. But it's more than that. I believe my life goal is to restart the Guild of Recreators and train young Talans to become the next generation of crafters. That's a respectable goal, Nurkan. I wish you the best. Hi, Nurkan. Have a souvenir. It's free. Keep a low profile, man. Hi, Nurkan. Have a souvenir. It's free. Let me see what you got. I've been busy. More blue helium. 
Sweet. Ulakai, do you have time to answer a question? Surely, as I'm an open book. Isn't it strange you found these calm links in an invader's base? The invaders don't seem to communicate with any form of spoken language. Why would they need that sort of device? Ah, oh, yeah, you got a point there. Maybe their leaders use them. They're hiding behind their soldiers, I don't know. Maybe. Thank you for your time, Ulukai. Lia's out. Damn. I don't... She knows I'm different than the monster.
This Daruman combines the sweet blessings of the sky and the bitter salt of the sea. A fragile gift that holds a greater power. I would only trust it in the hands of our worthiest ambassador. I'm honored, Zalab. I'll bring this to Kizar myself. Sapa's Daramon could break easy. The Almayel hears you. May the Yods favor your quest for our sake. The Almayel hears you. Till next time.
helpful and oh so harmful. Soldier, are you on this frequency? What's the emergency? No emergency, but according to the map, looks like we're down to one last base that remains inaccessible. Any way you can help me with this one? I'm on it. Sorry. I've been busy with something else. Want to share a bit of this something else? Not now. Soon. I marked the coordinates on your map. The fence should be gone by the time you get there. Take care, Commander. Thanks for everything. Hope to see you on the other side of this. Slate out. Shit, here they come. Brought the whole battalion, huh?
is open. Unair is back in one piece, Chief. Bless the odds for your courage, stranger. If only we could pierce the invaders' armor and strike their cold hearts. But we will never fight them off. About that, Baram and Unair came up with an interesting idea. Ooh, an idea? I like a nice, juicy idea. If they found a way to hurt the invaders, I'm in. How can the Chief of Sapa help? Keep training more Ventilope Riders, and tell them this has nothing to do with fishing. This is war. I'll ask you, Nair, to give me the details. Thanks again for your help. You remind me of a bedtime story my mother used to tell me in Kizar. Let me guess, the Ulakai one? I see you're familiar with it, too. My brother used to love that tale. Oh, yeah? Well, it's funny you mention it, because... It's the kind of idealistic propaganda that got him reverted. Sorry to bother you with my gloomy memories. Y you were saying... Nothing. I, uh... Barely remember the story anyway. What do you want me to aim at? The Gamors. Mating season's over and they're hungry, of course. So they're coming back to Sapa to feast on us. Can you get rid of them? I've already done that, so... What can you tell me about Zalab? Oh, you want to sit and chat with the chief, huh? Discuss the personal life of every single one of my people while sipping on lampe and snacking on grilled senegda? Fine, but only after you deal with our gamma problem, please. I've already done that, so... Is everything set? Oh, I love the smell of dark halidium in the morning. I have a squad of riders waiting for instructions and enough ventilopes for a test flight. Should we bomb those invaders into oblivion? For my brother? For Sapa? I thought you'd never ask. I'll come back later. Zalab, we have to talk. I'm here. Liaz told me you have a loaded boat ready to go. Yeah. Give me the signal, and I'll have my people bring the boat to shore.
it moving. Bring the Helidium through the spear before the invaders spot us. But trust me, the Almayel will open the spear for us. You did good, Lias. Hold on. I can't believe I'm back in Kizar after all these cycles. Thank you, Ulakai. Yes. 
What is a Dalatai guardian doing in Kizar? Her exile is over. We need to band together and face the invaders as one race. United by the Yods. You did this. You brought Sankra to Kizar. I asked him to. The Dalatai guardians will be strong allies. Strong? Strength incites Sankra, and Sankra destroys Melia. Sankra can be controlled. Control is merely another step towards Sankra. You've served well, human. Take this half of Kizar's Daramon as a token of the Almayel's gratitude. something this is not a good time message I feel a little guilty I didn't want to make you and your sister split up the dissonance in the Alma Yella's voice has never been so intense and yet there's something so liberating to it I see the strength of Sankra I know about dissonance my relationships never worked out Melia must prevail in the Yod's realm but blindly pursuing harmony on our mortal plane leads to weakness. Adelpha weakens with each passing moon. Look, don't overthink it. This storm will pass. It was good talking to you, Almael. I have to leave now. Walk where the Yods can see you. Yell, are you all right? You were seriously upset before. Mad? I... I am not mad. I... It feels like half of myself is constantly fighting the other half. Maybe you're turning into a human because, you know, that's how we feel all the time. It's... it's not funny. The dissonance has never been that intense between the... between me and... her! The separation is confusing. The violent nature of Sankra is consuming the foundations of the Melia between us. The Melia on which the whole of Talan society stands. <sighs> Admit it. It feels good to reunite a mother with her kid. Liaz is a good person. Liaz is a child of Fey, and so is Ishana. They're both stubborn and rebellious, easily tempted by violence, prey to becoming domineering. Remember how Feyran used to rule this part of the world? The Fey essence has nothing to do with it. I remember Anthony Xu. He was a jealous and frustrated man who chose to rule by force. Luckily, his Feyran act ended when his palace collapsed. He has no legacy, and Liaz is nothing like him. Her Fey essence burns strong. She has the same rage as her father. You knew her father? A vicious warlord. His name was never revealed to Liaz for her own sake, but because of that difficult decision, she grew up missing a part of her identity, filling that void with adventure stories, just like her daughter, Ishana. The Almayel should have told Ishana about who Liaz was. My mistake is why Yan could manipulate them both. A warlord? I only remember one Talan who fits that description, and... No. It can't be. Croax. Even reverted. 
his fey essence is a lurking danger for the Talan race. I feel you. These memories should be buried forever. It's better if Liaz never knows about this. By Melia, you are holding Kizar's Daramon, united once again. An impressive deed. You have gathered the trust of the Talan people and reconciled the Dolatai guardians with the Almayel. Praise the Yods, for you are truly a friend of Adelpha. And I'm glad this is gonna be over soon. The Yods have spoken. Do you feel them? They are listening. Kizar shall sing for the survival of Adelpha. Let Augustak begin! Always. I'm joking. Akastok is going well. I feel the joy of my people, even if it's only for a short while. I feel you. We all deserve a break. Where's Alma? She... she's somewhere. I don't know. We haven't spoken this moon. There's Sankra between us. Ah, Sankra. Always Sankra. Do you mind if I ask you a personal question? Ask away, but I might not answer. On this island, a lot of couples are forming, but you're here alone. I mean, there must be a man. I mean, a, a male. Or maybe a female that you're, I don't know. Attracted to? 
Have you ever been in love, human? Whoa, I go personal or you go deep? You don't have to answer. No, I, I want to, I just, I don't have the answer. But you have a child. What happened between me and Wolf, uh, Marion? It was a moment. It happened on a mission. We were drawn to each other, and that was great. But back home, uh, it's so hard sometimes to just communicate. We never really got a chance to be together, to really try us out as, like, a couple. You wanted to? She met someone else uh, before she even knew she was pregnant, and I'm not the type of guy who takes a day off to assemble a crib, so... Anyway, she's gone, and it feels like a rock in my gut. Pulling me down. This... Marion... Why do you call her Wolf? Well, that was her code name. On our first mission together. Supposed to keep things professional, you know? So, it was not love. Well, I came to know her better on Adelpha. Wish I would have saved her, but I, I don't know how I felt. It's just... the damned guilt again, clouding everything. We didn't have enough time, I guess. She is with Yad Ka now. I sense her essence through your words. You understand exactly how I'm feeling right now, don't you? Sit next to me. Let's feel her essence together. Croax. Some names you're happy to... Get enough of these plants. Slate, I finally have good news. Yankees won the World Series? There is no World Series anymore. And, well, no Yankees. I've been through a lot today, but this hurts the most. Listen up. I located a personal transport. This is your ticket to the orbital portal, but... But? No, there's no but, my friend. The yachts kept their promise. I am going home. Yeah. There's something I should probably tell you, though. Save it for later. Just hit me with the coordinates. Your call, Commander. The personal transport's location should be popping up on your map. We'll talk later. Signing off. Ulukai, I see new coordinates on the map. My guardians are not far from there, but there's a problem. What kind of problem? They spotted multiple invaders hidden around some kind of machine. If this is what you're after, it's obviously a trap. But don't worry. The Dolotai Guardians are going to surprise them. We have powerful weapons now. Don't do anything recklessly, Az. Wait for me. I'm on my way. I'm not waiting. We're moving in. Hurry up, Ulukai, or you'll miss the battle. Liaz out. Liaz? No! God damn it. I better get that fast. I hope she knows what she's doing. Slave to Liaz. Do you read me?
That's it. No more drills. Liaz, please come in. Did anything happen? Oh, this ain't normal. Yes, what happened? You inspired us, Ulokai. The Dolotai Guardians are celebrating their first victory oh, against the oppressor. Every village helped us win. I told you to wait for me before using the weapons. Shooting guns is easy. It's like a second nature to me. Almost like it runs in my blood. Slade, your position's compromised. Get out of there now. Who was that? It's no one. We have to run, Lias. Run! We are done running! The Yods have united the Talans behind you, Ulakai. We fight! Human too. See? Drop your weapon. Slade, do as he says. Trust me, I'll protect you. You? You're one of them? Yes. I mean, no, no, I'm not. I'll, I'll explain. Commander Slade? It's... I've seen you. You don't even remember me. How about this? You gave it to me 20 years ago. Wait, what? Oh my god! Camilla? No! You really speak their language. Baby girl, I can't believe I've been gone 20 freaking years. You haven't aged a single day. How's that possible? Listen to me. It doesn't matter. Daddy's back for you. Just like I promised. The alien stole my necklace. We need to catch her. We're the aliens here, and that necklace is part of her religion. Do you have any idea of its value to me and the whole human race? Hey, relax. There's plenty of these glowing stones around. I'll, I'll get you another one. So you have access to the source of the quantum crystals? Quantum what? You mean Halidium? That stone is the most powerful source of energy ever discovered by mankind. Not by mankind, by the Talans. And it was just a present, not a free pass to steal all of the Talans' resources. And you chose these Talans over your people? Your family? I tried to save everyone. And what did I get in return? Death penalty. You got my mother killed than half the population of Earth. That's why they executed you. Please don't listen to Jack's lies. 
Your heart knows the truth. I know it does. I'm your father. I missed you too, baby girl. And I'm sorry, Daddy. You're under arrest. No! Uh, Camilla, listen! I'm not armed, please. I know you understand me. Camilla, um, tell yes, I'm sorry. Don't be sorry. Raising an orphan by yourself can be tough, but so rewarding. Camilla graduated first of her class. Never missed a single one of my birthdays. Such my a good daughter! Girl. I need to talk to her! Your daughter? I adopted Camilla, comforted her, and taught her everything she knows. What did you do? Look, I didn't kill Marion. Camilla is all I have left of her mother. We were about to get married. That mission, you and these miserable aliens ruined my life. What kind of general is willing to exterminate a whole race for his personal grudge? Good thing that Camilla doesn't have your genes. She sees a different way. That's why she put you in shackles. My day die your tour ne four. And you learn their language, that's so sweet. And I need a translator. Yeah, dream on, I'd rather die. Again. Help me interrogate the prisoners. And seize the source of quantum crystals. Or I start shooting their leaders one by one. We have a code magenta situation, sir. Camilla. What did Camilla do this time? She went after the aliens to negotiate, and... It's not clear what happened, sir, but... Spit it out! She went AWOL. HQ lost her signal. They think the aliens got her. Show me her last position on the thermal grid. Now. She was under your surveillance. I'm sorry, General. I saw Camilla going straight to Lias. Shit. I gotta get out of here. Commander Slade. My friend. It's you, is it? The voice in my ear. Commander Slade, I am Colonel Vernon, the major that recruited you 20 years ago. Sending you to Adelpha was a suicide mission, and I'm sorry. Water under the bridge. Doesn't matter anymore. You're gonna bail me out. I don't have the code to your cell. Yes, you do. Shoot me. Have you lost your mind? We'll meet again. Trust me.
I can't believe I'm doing this. I hope you know what you're doing, soldier. Now, for the first time in moons, I think I do, my friend. It worked. Now I just need to get out of here and find Camilla. Stop crying. It only makes you look weak. They say Daddy is a traitor. Didn't want me die because of him. Nothing hurts more than the truth, Camilla. I hate them. Hush now. It's okay. I'm here. I'm gonna talk to those boys. They're the ones who are gonna be sorry. Trust me. This can help a lot of people, Camilla. Don't you want to save the world? All right. You can have it. But only for a little bit, okay? I promise. My friends just want to have a quick look at it in their lab. The Vortex left humanity with almost no resources. So of course... Oh. Hey, it's me. He's alone. Should I press the trigger? I don't know. I've never done this before. Trust me, pal. You don't want to start today. Oh, God, I'm sorry. What are you doing? You hurt the ass. No surrender. The Galenter is throwing Mordax at us again. Let's get out of here. Where's Doc? And... What's with the makeup? Doc is gone. Since the humans took all the chiefs, we, on Sankras, are leading the uprising. United behind Lias, Talans will fight back! But not this moon. It's on Sankras. Oh boy. I got a bad feeling about this.